Hey YouTube, it's Satish here. Welcome to OSB 12C examples. In this video, we learn how to create a basic OSB program using OSB 12C. Now I'm going to create a new application. Service bus application. OSB 12C examples this is my application name now I'm going to create a project so click on the projects click on service bus project hello world this is my project OSB project name save all now I'm going to create a couple of folders in this project. Go to the folder location. One for schema and one for visual, one for proxy. Now just come back and refresh your project. the three folders are ready so now I'm going to create a schema under schema folder XML schema my project is hello world schema name is hello world now I'm going to create a namespace for this one is checkbus.me it's my website so schema slash hello world Now I'm going to give a prefix for this namespace like HW, HW OPJ. So it's under create. So take care about this. Or select folder. Now fine. It's good. Now it looks good. Now this is the default element is created. Now I'm going to delete default element. So for request response, we need to create the two elements. The two elements is already ready with me. I'm just copy paste. Right. So everything is good. Refresh, come to design mode and see request and response. Hello world request message. Hello world response message. Nice. Save all. Now I'm going to create a visual under visual folder. Click on visual folder and right click look for the visual builder. Yes. Now give the name as a visual name is a hello world. Binding name is hello world binding name and port type is also I'm changing to hello world. And operation is also same. Now I'm going to create an interface type is synchronous synchronous type. We once we send the request, we immediately we are expecting a response. Now an input and output. Just we created the schema will point to that elements. The part name is like a request part name and URL hello world request just we created right now and output is response response same select as a hello world response click ok now my visual is ready with me and save all and go to source code see everything's it's called hello world hello world binder okay, fine now click on the composite plan drag and drop the pipeline pair into center streamline and name it as like hello world pipeline select next and service type is 
visitor type, select the visitor type because we have the visitor type based, right? Select the visitor. Yes, select the hello world visitor. Fine. Now binding is also hello world. Now expose the proxy service as hello world proxy service. Right. Now protocol is HTTP protocol location is proxy location is the process the proxy folder selected proxy folder right and the bindings okay that's good and come back and select the pipeline location is also proxy folder right everything looks good finish save all and click on the pipeline pair and drag and drop the pipeline pair the request pipeline response pipeline okay now I'm going to choose request stage request stage now I'm going to change it to the response stage fine so drag and drop the assign activity Click on the expression. Now I'm going to select response variable. Now I'm clearly will do one thing, will create. Now come back to soap one one prefix. So PNV, this is the prefix, good. So, so hyphen ENV. Problem body, body, and close the body immediately. Control C, Control V now. Right. Now I'm creating XML format for this variable, response variable, under body, and this is the variable. Immediately close the variable. It has another child element like response variable. Now I'm going to create, sorry. Now remove this one. So we'll select two floor brackets and set the input variable. Wait. Right. So so anyone uh, enters the name and welcome to OS B. That's for that one we need to use concatenate function. So functions are here and we'll do string functions right the string functions look for the concat this is a concat function f n f n Use double quotations, comma, hello, name, after, again, use another one, like, welcome to OSP 12C, this is correct, now quotations are clear, right hello is closed 
and this is also closed now I'm going to close bracket now good fine okay so variable is body variable click on the body variable now we'll deploy the service into server deploy OSB server my server is up and running So deployment finish will test so log into the SP console local host colon SP console web logic see hello world was deployed and look for the to select the proxy service and click on the launch test console now i'm going to give the request as a satish patnala see i'm getting responses hi satish patnala welcome to osb 12c thank you friends if you have any doubts please post it on youtube Thank you.